were the first five women welders hired at the Kundi Four River shipyard during World War II. We were an experiment, but we must have done a good job because they kept us and hired many, many more women welders. We were tested and trained to see if women could do the job. They didn't know if we were capable. Then they started us out with small test spots. We excelled. Then they let us tack weld. We excelled. Then we were put on production welding and we excelled. We progressed fast. As we progressed, they hired more and more women. Being the first one of anything is something to be very proud of. It's something I can tell my grandchildren. I did. I feel like a pioneer and like a patriot. The young lady wanted to know how I became to have woo-woo on my jacket. It was because I had a nice figure and when I walked by the fellows would yell woo-woo. And so my girlfriend and I remarked that I chummed with decided to paint woo-woo on the back of my welding jacket and that's how it came about. So then they probably just called you that even more, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did the nickname stick? Oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Some people call me now after they say the article, see the articles, and they say, hey, woo, -woo. <laughs> <laughs> It's nice, so it's nice to be acknowledged.